1970s up against Atletico Madrid, the Europa League winners. Godin towards Diego Costa. And he can have a run up the round. Another start that was for Atletico Madrid. Diego Costa off and running with a bang. Real Madrid nil. Atletico Madrid won. A thunderous start. Here's Gareth Bale on a charge. In he goes towards Benzema. Bale the provider. Benzema the finisher. And the European champions level in the Super Cup final. Real Madrid won. This is nothing but pace. Look at that. Have some of that. Tony Kroos. And they're appealing for, penal for a penalty and they've got it. Tell you what, no mess. It's Sergio Ramos. And it's calmly done by the most experienced man in the Real Madrid team. And the European champions. Good determination showed there by Juan Fran and then Correa and then there's Costa. Well, they managed to tee it up this time. Determination at the outset and then a clinical finish from close range. His second tonight for Diego Costa. And it's Real Madrid 2, Atletico Madrid 2 with 11 and a half minutes to go. Yeah, right in front of the Real Madrid fans. And in straight away. So he gets it back from Diego Costa. And then, oh, oh, what a finish! No emotion whatsoever from Diego Simeone, but that's an absolute rocket from Sal Niguez. And there's another oh. opportunity and another goal. Same response from Diego Simeone. Two goals in quick succession from Atletico Madrid. And that one side for that nickel. This is just strength. Look, get out my way. And then he knows. Sarabia releases Jesus Navas. Real Madrid struggling to defend this. And Silva scores. And it is no more than Sevilla deserves. They've taken this game to Real Madrid from the very first whistle. Up. He may go himself here, Jesus Navas, saved by Courtois, in by Silva, 2-0 for Sevilla, Silva is gold in Andalusia, and just listen to the noise, barely any outward emotion from Pavel. The flag stays down, 3-0, brilliant finish from this hot striker. Wissam Ben Yedder, sixth goal for him in the last three games. They stand, they stare, they contemplate. But Real Madrid are being... Hold the midfield along with the Kyrgyzstan-born Akhmatov. Off we go. On the bench, Dean, given that they're missing so many players. Cross, that's a poor ball. And it's 1-0 to CSK Moscow. Nikola Vlasic from the terrible pass by Tony Kroos. And what a surprise here inside two minutes. Gave the ball away that night and he's done it again. It's so Casemiro though. He's gone for it and struck the bottom of the post. They let him come a long, long way and very nearly paid the penalty. Reguillon's cross into the middle. Benzema's there. Hits the woodwork. And wouldn't come down for a centre. Bissau got a touch on it. Cross thinks about a shot. But this was the one, this was the... Ceballos, Audrey Thoros cross, is this the moment? Oh, they've hit the woodwork again. He powered the head of Mariano Diaz, leapt into the air, great effort off the woodwork. We won't give them much more time. Ceballos with it into the penalty area. Oh, that was the chance. It's come and gone for Varane, and the header blocks wide. And the referee didn't allow anything for the sending off and the brouhaha, nothing at all. And CSK Moscow here have landed one of their greatest ever European victories. And it is perhaps the biggest story of the Champions League. Se enfrentaban en el duelo correspondiente a la octava jornada en la Liga Santander y en Mendiza, que en la segunda. Ahí está Álvaro Odriozola para meter ese centro. Y es Karim Benzema y la guardia el que salva sobre la línea de gol. Estaba bien colocado también Maripan en el, en el uno contra uno ante Rubén Duarte. No había nada punible para Jaime Latre. 
espada de Johnny con Rafael Barán. Oportunidad clarísima dentro del área. El tiro acaba saliendo fuera. Ahora la posición de central. Y atentos ahí. Porque Mano García dominando el espacio aéreo en el último suspiro, en el último saque de esquina, lograba ese gol para darle los tres puntos al Deportivo a la vez. Así se quedaba Julen López Tegui. Era la última acción del partido. El Madrid que iba a perder y se iba a quedar cuatro partidos sin ganar y sin marcar. Y Rubén Sobrino. Taylor now has to, to face his former side. It's Courtois between the sticks. Audrey Azola, Varane. Campagna, of course, who knows. Uh... It's a lovely ball forwards. Morales with a brilliant first touch, and there's the first goal of the game. And it's a stunner from Jose Morales. Well, they've just cut through once again, weren't they? The soft centre of the Real Madrid defence exposed once more, and you can hear the whistles from the home supporters exactly. You out wide, back into Roger Marti. It's a free kick, a handball, I think, from Rafael Varane. And a free kick right on the edge of the Levante area. And this, Pete, is very dangerous because Levante have a man called Ennis Bardi who is an authentic Pete. And it's Roger Marti, and he finds the back of the net. And Levante are leading two goals to nil here at the Santiago Bernabeu. Well, he got very close to it, Courtois, but not close enough. And uh... intelligently, it's Karen Benzema. No one's going for goal at the moment. Marcelo strikes it, and Marcelo scores. Well, it was good build-up from Real Madrid. They've improved in this second half, and you could say that that goal was coming. Well, at first it looked as if Benzema's pass was poor because it certainly wasn't to Marcelo, but actually slightly being to the right of him, it enabled him just to wrap his foot around it. And uh, fantastic finish. At the end. Barcelona are unchanged. The 11th of the recent run of results for Real Madrid. And Nacho just flicks the ball away and he's straight into the path of... It'll be the referee's eventual final decision. There he is, taking a look. At what to make it 2-0. No mistake from the Uruguayan. Seven goals in the Clásico now for Luis Suárez. Busquets, Rafinha, shots on. And he didn't miss the far angle by much. No. Towards his goals, much better from Real Madrid, Marcelo! Scores for the third successive game, the Brazilian. And Real Madrid are certainly right back into this Clásico. The fans getting anxious and with every good reason because Modric has hit the inside of the post. Sergio Roberto in behind, Suarez off the post. Lovely move from Barcelona. It's a patient build-up. Pass here. And Barcelona have Real Madrid stretched to very good effect. It's a wonderful header from Luis Suarez. Well, Real Madrid have looked several times. Look, Ramos and Suarez is in for a hat trick. No mistake. The 25th hat trick in Clásico history. To Luis Suarez. Game over. Here, this is Dembele. Oh, it must be. It is. Arturo Vidal. It was that 
crucial period when Modric hit the inside of a post and Benzema put a free header from close range over the top. No question that Barcelona deserved to win.